The jury on climate change is still out and debate is rife. And it doesn't matter whether it's fact or fiction, the question is, are you going to do nothing and take a risk? Or do you want to save yourself some money and do something about it now? Well, with the constant increase in gas and electricity prices, now is the time. And I'm going to show you how you can get hot water free from the sun. You guessed it, it's solar. Come with me. Firstly, if you have one of these old electric water heaters, you'll be shocked to know that these account for around 25% of a household's energy use. So that alone is a good enough reason to get rid of it. And not to mention freeing up space down the side of your house. What's next? We'll get an assessment of your roof space done to make sure it's facing the right aspect and has enough room to supply enough energy. And while you're at it, take advantage of Solar Heart's $300 off the trade-in. Plus, there's also some great rebates available. The government is introducing plans to phase out electric hot water heaters in all states other than Tasmania from next year. If these plans go ahead, homeowners will be required to install an environmentally friendly alternative and can claim the $1,000 rebate for solar water heaters and a $600 rebate for a heat pump. There are also some great state government incentives over and above this, so now is the time to get in and beat the rush. The installers of these units are professionals, so it's probably best to leave them to it. There are two types of solar. One that uses the light from the sun and turns this into electricity, known as solar photovoltaic or solar power. And the other uses the heat from the sun and transfers this to heat your water, solar hot water. Most people install solar hot water as a first step to going solar because it is so efficient. Right, so the old electric hot water system has been replaced by this solar heated beauty and all that's left that's hooked into the grid is the booster and that kicks in on those not so sunny days. All in all, this system could reduce your energy consumption by up to 50 to 90 per cent. Switching to low emission technologies like solar water heaters is a great way to get your greenhouse emissions down because it can reduce it by about three tonnes per year when compared to your electric hot water systems. So that's like taking a four-cylinder car like this one off the road. Solar hot water for me is a no-brainer.